Hello everyone, I am Santosh. Today we are going to discuss the difference between malloc and calloc functions. Okay, last class nali now calloc function andre eno matte adar mailo an program bar didvi iwaga. What is the difference between malloc and calloc? Anta noro na okay. And let us see the difference by feature. Okay, by taking some of the features. First, I will write the feature and whether it is there in malloc or what is there in calloc. Okay. We will check features and the difference. Martha Huna. Okay. Let us see what is the meaning of malloc. First, I will take the meaning as one of the feature or one of the point to differentiate what is the meaning of malloc malloc and memory allocation simple what is calloc contiguous allocation contiguous and continuous like allocate agate and tartha okay will it initializes the memory yaudu or both of them will they initialize means memory initialization uh, malloc will it initialize the memory no but calloc will initialize the memory yes malloc garbage Melancholy garbage store Tiantana Hirti after creating the memory, but CLOC Nali memory is initialized with zero. Okay, what is the initial data? Andre memory create at Takshna initially in data other Lirute Melancholy Nirte garbage garbage and unknown value. We don't know what it is. But CLOC null inerte zero. CLOC is initialized with zero. Now let us check another feature or point to differentiate number of arguments. While creating with the help of while creating the memory with the help of malloc. Now we are going to write the syntax whether the syntax has how many number of arguments it has only one argument new syntax check but calloc has two arguments this is also one of the difference now let us see which one is efficient how the efficient anta nodana or less time consuming malloc is faster than calloc why calloc is slower because it takes time to initialize calloc in madatte while creating it initializes the memory with zero i initialize model it takes a time that's why it is slower than malloc. Malloc will not initialize, it will not take some time to do that. Already some garbage will be there. Okay. Which one allocates the memory continuously? That is contiguous memory. Contiguous memory means continuous allocation. Melancholy continuous allocate arg bodu aglikilla may or may not, but see locally definitely. Yes, it will allocate the memory continuously. Okay, got it? Very simple. These are some of the difference between malloc and calloc. Now let us see one program to differentiate malloc and calloc 
let us write a simple program to demonstrate the difference between malloc and cloc okay malloc matto cloc nadue yen differences ide anta nododakke ondu program anta bariyona okay uh, let us start with hash include stdio.h and this is common for all the programs you are writing and very important thing is you should include the std lib dot h header file because this will support the dynamic memory allocation okay wide main dynamic memory allocation work agbekandre you std lib dot h header file anna include maadkolle beku means standard library header file and all the dynamic memory allocation functions are included in std lib dot h okay let us take uh, one variable i and i will create two pointers int star p comma star q because i want to use both malloc and cloc malloc matu cloc eradannu use madbekagide adakke eradu pointers anna create madidini okay now let us create the memory with the help of malloc p equal to int star malloc how we are going to write 3 into size of int what it indicates total size how many how much size we are going to create or allocate 3 into size of int is 4 bytes means total it will allocate 12 bytes of memory large block of 12 bytes of memory okay. next i will allocate the memory with the help of cloc int star for that we have taken another pointer cloc 3 comma size of int how this allocates the memory it allocates three blocks of memory and which are of type integer but malloc will allocate totally 12 blocks of or 12 bytes of memory where it can be divided into size of whichever data type you are using okay let us print size of or let us try to print the default values in both p and q printf default values in p just heading i want to print andre p in and the create maadi divala now malloc use maadkondu p use maadkondu memory allocate maadi divi adaralli default a yen values irthave anta we want to print it nimage gottide malloc alli athwa malloc inda memory allocate agidre definitely alli en irutte default agi garbage irutte that we want to show okay let us try to print there are there will be three three values because size of int is four bytes okay how i will print with the help of for loop i equal to zero i less than three i plus plus definitely only more values are more n values are that those are all garbage values okay because size of int is four bytes four bytes of three blocks total 12 bytes printf let us print what is there in p I'm taking as percentage d 
I don't know whether they are integer or any garbage value. Star P plus I. What is this? First value is stored in the P plus 0th address that we are printing using star. Next value is stored in P plus 1 address that we are storing with the help of star. Sorry, that we are printing with the help of star. Getting? You are here, you know, P in a little values and print modded via the Tara Q in a little values and print modded. No, 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 print F. Default values in Q. Anta one heading mod Bardidini. Let us print using loop for i equal to zero, i less than three, i plus plus. So it is zero, one, two. Totally three integers will be there or three default values percentage d star of q plus i because we have created using q got it it here work how it can be represented or traced let us see we have created uh, the memory we have allocated the memory with the help of p and q how it allocates first with the help of p p using we have done with malloc node a 3 into size of int and rest to total size of int is 4 bytes 3 into 4 is 12 blocks of sorry 12 bytes of memory is allocated okay this one i am showing now 12 bytes of memory allocate i to and uh, let us think that the address of first byte is thousand and uh, size of int is four bytes total 12 bytes means how it can be divided like this means size of int of first place is that is 4 bytes and this is also 4 bytes and this is also 4 bytes totally 12 bytes of memory is allocated first address is 1000 next will be 1004 next will be 1008 what is stored in p now p in a lane store I get the 1000 because p holds the starting address of allocated memory and what will be there inside this create madi takshna now either only value store madilla inu store madilla andre definitely a linear the garbage okay adetara e point ali in agutyanta nodona okay this will create the three blocks of memory all are of type integer okay this is type integer 4 byte 4 byte 4 byte again it is also what 12 bytes of memory and it can have some address like 2000 next address will it will be 2004 2008 what will be the address of q sorry what is stored in q that is 2000 but what is stored here when it is created with the help of c lock there will be zero okay this is the difference let us print what are default values in p default values p nalli in default values values idi anta nodona default values in p anta now print maartta idivi okay 
i equal to 0 0 less than 3 is true then star of p plus 0 p plus 0 means this is the first first address first address nalli en store ide adar address en ide adar rogiro value star means adar rogiro value that is garbage garbage and it can be any number like this i don't know what it is also okay. next i plus plus 1 less than 3 true star of p plus 1 p plus 1 means it is the next address star of p plus means it is the value inside that next address it can be any value be unknown value because it is garbage i don't know what it is okay next i plus plus i is equal to 2 2 less than 3 is true star of p plus 2 p plus 2 is the next address what is there inside that address that is indicated with the help of star star of p plus 2 is is again the garbage value i don't know what it is just i will write you can just execute the code you will get okay you are what i thought how it works i don't know what the values are because Garbage and the end and the end and the unknown it is okay. Now we come here because I becomes 3, 3 less than 3 is false. Now print default values in Q. Q nulli in default values is the print model now. Okay. Q means it is created with the help of log function i equal to 0 0 less than 3 is here we are now i equal to 0 0 less than 3 i plus plus okay 0 less than 3 is true true and right come inside the loop star of q plus i what is that star of q plus i q plus i means q plus 0 means the first address other value value no? 0 next i plus plus 1 less than 3 true true means it comes inside star of q plus 1 and the next address other value value no? again it is 0 i plus plus 2 less than 3 is true star of q plus 2 what is that it is again the next address other value no? 0 i plus plus 3 less than 3 is false it comes outside the loop and program has ended you are printing default values in p we don't know the values it is all garbage because it has been created with the help of malloc but in order default values in q we are printing and all the values are zero because CLO initiates the memory with zero. Arthaita just try to execute the code. Code execute mod nodi and nim gotagate how it works. Okay. Understood? If you have any doubts, you can comment. Thank you.